tell us who you are, who you work for, and what your responsibilities are. Uh, my name is Chase Golick. I work for Tyson Foods, and I'm an industrial engineer. And so, what, and what do you do for Tyson? Uh, basically, an industrial engineer at a plant, basically uh, in charge of taking care of cost measures, mainly labor, since that's the largest cost uh, to the company. So, set engineered standards and follow. And you got a degree from Iowa State. Yep, industrial. Yeah. Technology. technology. Yeah. How long have you been with Tyson? Uh, six years. Six years. So, as you you're at, you're at the career fair, so what is it you're looking for in potential hires? Looking for somebody that's got a good, uh, you know, try and try and develop good communication skills, be able to communicate, and hopefully that's something we learn right here. You know, that's openness to talk. Um, and then, yeah, you know, if they have any, you know, hopefully background with any type of time studies that they would, you know, mainly we're looking for high tech degrees and industrial engineering. Um, because I think Tyson, we have, as long as they have those base skills, they'll, they'll mold you into, into what you need. So, um, but yeah, that's, that's mainly it. I mean, so I think it's you're evaluated on an annual basis. So what, what are you evaluated yeah. on? Like what kind of skills or well, we have, competencies? We, like we do have some performance goals. We're... We're supposed to, uh, the, the largest one basically is to come up with a specific number of cost reductions or a goal um, for that. Uh, you know, we really have a hand in everything too, so we're tied to a lot to the plant performance, um, even all the way down to the safety score. Um, uh, and also, I guess I forgot to mention, we're in charge of the ergonomics program as well. So uh, I, I know when I went to school with industrial technology, there was a safety function or a safety major. Um, you know, it, it's more of a mesh now, uh, you know, where we, how Tyson does it. So um, it was good to get some of those safety classes in and help prepare for, uh, you know, what's coming your way in the future. So, but uh, yeah, we're measuring on a whole set of goals from yields to cost reductions. So now that you've been out in the industry for six years and you reflect back on your undergraduate experience, is there anything you would have done different, different course you would have taken, different experiences you would have had? You know, for the most part, we practice, and I just got done telling a student about this, pretty much everything that we learned I practiced to an extent, one time or another. Maybe not every day, maybe not every week, but it comes up. Uh, you know, anymore, times are changing and we're trying to catch up, so I think, you know, I don't know what's going on right now as far as some of the courses. I know some courses have changed. I, I can't say I'd do anything differently. It's worked out well so far. But I know as times change, you know, schooling needs to change too, and I think it is, and, and it's adapting. So, and, and the workplace is catching up with that now. So, I, I wouldn't say I'd change anything really, but, but thank you.